Assalamu alaikum my dear students hope you are fine by the grace of almighty allah welcome to niev's home school i'm nasma akhtar assistant teacher of science national ideal english version school morning shift dear students today i'm going to take an elementary science class for class 4 students dear students our today's topic is chapter 7 today we will uh, finish uh, this reading this chapter and today we will do also fill in the blanks of this chapter let's see today's topic from here our today's topic is chapter 7 today we will read page number 51 to 54 and today we will solve fill in the blanks of this chapter and this is lecture number 5 and today's hw number is 4 number hw dear students let's begin the class students look at here this is page number 51 51 number page and here is uses of natural resources for energy production natural resources provide us with energy we need for our daily life energy is the ability to do things Energy can move something, make sound and produce light and heat. Now come to here. This is 52 number page. People use some natural resources to get energy. Anything that can be used to produce energy is called an energy resource. Energy resource. Sunlight, wind, water current oil coal and natural gas are energy resources sunlight the sunlight is an important energy resource people use solar panel to get energy from the sun solar panel are devices that transform sunlight into electricity we may have seen solar panel on the roof roofs of houses or on a calculator look at here this picture here is solar panel solar panel transform sunlight into electricity now come to here wind wind is one of the most promising energy resources people use wind to produce electricity when the wind turns the blades of a wind turbine its spines are generator and produce electricity look at here this picture wind turns the blades of wind turbine turbines now look at here water current water current is one of the energy resources water current turns the blades of the of a turbine and spines are generated to produce electricity here is uh, the picture water current from dam generates electricity now come to here oil coal and natural gas oil coal and natural gas are non-renewable resources they are called fossil fuels when they are burned they produce heat the heat is used to cook food to run vehicles to produce electricity and to warm uh, houses in the cold countries students now come to here this page 53 number page conservation of natural resources conservation is the preserving and wise use of natural resources natural resources are limited so we need to conserve natural resources there are many ways that we can conserve natural resources reducing the uses of resources the best way to conserve natural resources is being economical while using natural resource when we reduce trash or energy use we use fewer natural resources for example we can turn out gas burner after cooking reusing resources we have learned how we can reuse paper by making bag with it when we use something we can reduce trash and help save natural resources 
we should use something over and over again before recycling or throwing it away when something is broken we should try to fix it instead of putting it in the trash and buying it again new students now come to here next page this is 54 number page recycling resources recycling is using old materials to make new things recycling is using old materials to make new things if we recycle we do not have to use more natural resources for example by recycling paper we can reduce the number of trees cut down a year because paper is made from trees now look at here using renewable resources people people get most of electricity mainly from non-renewable resources such as oil coal and natural gas however non-renewable resources cannot be replaced once they have been used up instead we should use renewable resources such as sunlight wind and water current now come to here changing behaviors the best way to conserve natural resources is to change our behaviors we can reduce our energy used by turning off lights when they are not needed. We can re reuse paper by writing on both sides of paper. We can also recycle the used cans or the old aluminium to make new things. Students, now we will do fill in the blanks. Here is page number 55 this fill in the blanks here is total five filling the blanks today we will solve this five i have written here this all filling the blanks look at here first fill in the blanks here is a dash is a material found in nature is that is use useful to people I'm uh, telling again a dash is a material found in nature that is useful to people. Answer is here a natural resource is a material found in nature that is useful to people. Two number gold, silver, etc. are dash resources. Gold, silver, etc. are dash resources. Answer is here gold silver etc are mineral resources mineral resources now three number three number here is oil coal and natural gas are dash fuel oil coal nat and natural gas are dash fuel answer is here oil coal and natural gas are fossil fuel answer is fossil fuel now four number through dash old things can be re reproduced into new things answer is here through recycle through recycle answer is recycle through recycle old things can be reproduced into new things now last one five number wind and water current are used to generate dash answer is here wind and water current are used to generate electricity answer is electricity students now i will give you hw our today's hw number is four number hw four number hw and your hw will be filling the blanks here is total five filling the blanks it will be your hw so dear students i hope you have understood today's topic keep practice it at home and do your assigned hw in your hw copy so dear students stay home and we'll see you again in our next class